This podcast is certified fresh. Freshmediaworks.com. Hey, everybody. Welcome back to The Marketing Drive. I'm Chris Daly, and this is the show where I talk about a marketing subject while I'm commuting. Uh, Today, it may be kind of loud in here because I'm driving on some back roads in Texas through Central Texas and uh, to go see a client. And these roads, although they're very nice, they're loud. (laughs) So ignore the noise. But as I've mentioned many times on this show, I don't edit. Uh, You get what you get because it's all about the details, it's all about the information and making it fast and something you can take action on. So, today I want to talk about uh, advertising on some of these social media platforms. You know, uh, Facebook added added ads. (laughs) I don't know why I find that funny. (laughs) Facebook added the ability to put ads on the site that you pay for um, a while back, and and that has has some some benefit. It has it's a really good price. Um, it, there's just some debate over whether or not there's some value to it. I think Facebook does have some some decent value. You have to be very very smart about how you target who you're reaching, and and realize why you're trying to do it. Are you doing it to brand something? Are you doing it to sell a widget? Um, and, and and those kind of decisions will affect how how well it works out for you. Now, today I want to talk about LinkedIn because LinkedIn recently added uh, the ability to sponsor a post or an ad, whatever, and um, it's a lot more expensive. I mean, I went in there, I did the, the free trial because they're pushing it hard by giving out codes, $50 worth of free advertising. Uh, of course, this is my business, so I have to investigate it. So I did. I blew through the $50 free thing pretty fast and then tried a couple different other things just so that when a client comes to me and says, hey, I'm thinking about advertising on LinkedIn, what do you think? Uh, I don't know what I'm talking about. So here for free is what I had to pay to learn. (laughs) Again, each of the ads are kind of uh, expensive. If you do on a per click, I think depending on the demographics of who you're trying to reach, it it can be, you know, $4 a click up to, you know, 20, 30, whatever, depending on how specific uh, a demographic you're trying to reach. So when you're trying to brand something, like I, I had just, to test it, I had put some of these episodes of uh, Marketing Drive just out there. Again, there's no direct return. When somebody clicks on it, I don't sell something. When somebody clicks on it, they go to where they can listen to this show for free. I make no money off it. So it's kind of expensive to pay five, six dollars a click for that. Also, I tried another option um, by trying to sell a specific item, one of the books that I wrote, I tried to sell on there. And when I did the demographics, got it down to who I wanted, the type of people I wanted to target, it was saying, yeah, it'll cost you $4 a click. I'm like, I'm selling this book. It's an ebook. It's on Amazon. Uh, I'm selling it for $5.99. <laughs> I make, when I sell that, you know, a buck and a half, maybe $2. I, I don't make much off of that. So even if every single click that I got, somebody purchased the book, which is unlikely, but even if that happened, I would be losing $2 a book. So, uh, so yeah, that's, that's not a, a good investment. So, so you can play around. You don't have to take the suggested amount. I think it said $4.40 was the suggested amount. So I knocked it down to a dollar just to see, I think $2 is the minimum. Yeah. Just to see again, $2 when my profit is about 250 is not worth it because guaranteed I'm not going to sell 100% of the clicks. So you have to pay attention to why you're trying to advertise, what the call to action is, and if it's worth it. Again, LinkedIn, much higher cost than some of the other uh, social media marketing platforms, but it would work great for something, whether, let's say you have a 
$200, a $500, a $3,000 item that specific uh, people with a specific job title that is a, a must-have for those guys, then yeah, it makes sense. Yeah, $4 a click is fine because if you sell one out of 100, what if you cost $400? Yeah, so it better be a couple thousand dollar item. <laughs> but, uh, so you have to do the math. You can't just say, yeah, I'll try it and see what happens. That's the problem. That's one of the problems with, with social media and, and the availability of all this stuff and the availability for you to reach all these different people. One of the problems is, hold on, I'm making a transition here. Got to merge. <laughs> yeah, in the middle of nowhere in Central Texas, I have to merge. But yeah, one of the problems there is that it's too easy for you to get out there and try things. And it always goes back to the thing I say over and over and over again. You have to measure. What you don't measure, you won't know. And what you don't know, you won't be able to tell, hey, I'm, I'm spending my money wisely or I'm spending it poorly. Anyway, I hope that helps, uh, and let me know if you've got some background, if you've got some information about uh, campaigns you've run on different social media platforms, definitely let me know. Or if you have some questions, use the voicemail line, 713-568-6361. Again, that is 713-568-6361, and it's, it's uh, Google Voice. It'll, it'll record up to three minutes of audio, um, and I'll put it on the show. All right. Again, this has been The Marketing Drive. I am Chris Daly, reminding you to keep it real. You've been listening to The Marketing Drive with Chris Daly. To learn more about how Chris can help your company get more customers, call 713-269-4620 or visit us on the web at freshmediaworks.com.